10 6 tonight, a group of Marshall residents who have been protesting the planned Ford electric vehicle battery plant may be one step closer to being heard by the city. Our Yasmin Ludi has their story. After a month of standing outside Marshall City Hall holding signs that say stop the mega site and asking other residents to sign a petition that would bring the battery plant rezoning to a citywide vote. This group of protesters finally had enough signatures to take that petition and drop it off to the city clerk. Earlier this month, City Council approved the request to rezone over 700 acres of the Marshall megasite to industrial and manufacturing zoning. However, some residents feel that should have been a citywide vote. Starting the first week of May, residents like Regis Klingler began collecting signatures for a petition that would give residents a say. In order for it to be accepted, they needed 10% of Marshall residents to sign. That's equivalent to 580 signatures. When the petition was dropped, dropped off to the city clerk's office. They had 127 pages filled with 810 signatures. Most residents say they're not opposed to an electric vehicle battery plant. They just don't think the site selected is a good fit. A lot of the people would like to stop this completely. Don't know if that's practical at this point, but we just want to be heard and we'd like to sit down with the city, with Meta, all the parties involved and we we don't want to see 3,000 acres of heavy industrial. 1,000 acres is a lot. Regis Klingler says they want to see that land used as a park, and they just want their voices to be heard. We'll continue following this petition and give you updates as they occur. Reporting in Marshall, Yasmin Ludi, Fox 17 News.